in this video let's see some depth in the topic of approximations basically we are going to solve numerical problems in the successive videos so we must have the knowledge about what all things are related to approximations so errors is one such subtopic which is very much related to approximations we already had seen that yes we are going to talk about del x we are going to talk about del y and we used to say that del x is the small change in x del y is the small change in y corresponding to the change in independent variable x so that means the change is what the change is what is the difference right difference or deviation from the actual value i can say so suppose i say one example of error would be i am about to say uh, you know calculate the area or the dimensions of any object of a book suppose i have been given a textbook and at this i am at the first page of the textbook and i am about to compute the dimensions means the length and the breadth of the page now the scale i had used for that purpose say the ruler scale was faulty it has some deviation in the value so if you it used to tell me that it is exactly 15 cm the page if the book is very uh, wide and long i am saying that if 15 cm is the length maybe the length would be 15.1 cm and there is an error in its the value it's computing the measurements so that is error means when you do not get the actual value but you are getting some value which is deviated from it error may be both in plus or minus that means you can either get what you can either get out of 15 cm which you should get suppose you are getting 15.1 or if 15 cm you should get you are getting 14.9 even that is error so error means any change or any deviation from the actual value the value is not equal to the original value now there are three types of error i have written in the order which you have actually understood and which you are familiar with you are more familiar with the word percentage and you are least familiar i guess with the word absolute and relative so i have written in that order but to study we'll be first studying absolute then studying relative and then studying percentage error now absolute error is what absolute error is when you have a change in the value that's it the deviation as such in the value is called as absolute error that means del x that is a deviation that is the deviation from the value so that del x is called as simply absolute error right next we are going to talk about relative error relative error is what relative error is nothing but the value obtained by the fraction of del x and x so del x upon x x is the original value right and del x is the deviation so del x upon x is the relative error last but not the least is percentage error so percentage error definitely is what relative error multiply by 100 because for percentage we always need to multiply by 100 right so that is your percentage error so in this manner you compute what are the different values of errors and you use them for approximations